DeepSeek just gave these companies another blow. We have V3, we have R1, and now we have Janus for image generation. As if NVIDIA stocks haven't gone down enough. The benchmarks are crazy. This Pro 7B, well, it's better than DALI 3. It's good. Honestly, I love it. I love it because this is a startup company that did a lot with way less. And that is exactly what we're going to try to do today. Before I start, it's not going to be millions of dollars. It's not a get-rich-quick scheme. It will depend on you. But it's a viable opportunity that I don't know why a lot of people skip on this. So Janus is available on Hug and Face. You can just Google for it like this. So Janus Pro Hug and Face Chat. Just do it like this. And it's going to be the first result here. You can download it as well. But this is if you want to do it in your browser right away. You can, of course, download it to your computer. You can read about it on Hugging Face. But if you click on that chat button, this is what you're going to get. First of all, you've got two of these, multimodal understanding, and then there's text to image generation. I'll show you what this does. It's pretty cool. But of course, we're going to focus on this because we want to generate images like this one. Isn't this cool? But the strategy today isn't going to involve realistic pictures. The strategy today is going to involve patterns. And don't worry, I'll lead you through it step by step. This is what I mean when I say patterns. This can make us money. This is a good side hustle. And all you have to do is to write a prompt like this. So it doesn't have to be too long. You don't have to do it on your own. You can just use DeepSeek to write you a prompt for it. And these are some of the examples that you can generate with it. Now, for realism is not so good. So I'm just going to focus on this. Because in order to make something like this, you have to have a really, really long prompt. And you have to practice a lot, right? So we're going to stick to patterns. But before we go, I just want to get this out of the way. This is multimodal understanding. So what does this mean? You can put an image here, whichever one you want. For example, I'll just put an Eiffel Tower here. And down there, you can ask it a question. So for example, what is this and why should I know about it? Now, click on the chat button here and you're going to get a response. It's going to prompt you to buy something because as you can see, my quota is exceeded. But you just have to make another account for yourself. And as you can see now, it has successfully acquired a GPU and the answer is there. So this is the Eiffel Tower, a famous landmark located in Paris, France. Blah, 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 blah. Pretty cool, right? You can take a picture with your phone as well to discover the world around you. But let's get back to the money meta. For me, it is phone cases, right? What I do, I sell phone cases. I do it on Etsy, I do it on eBay, and I do it on some local sites. And I use patterns like these or some other ones, but you don't have to do it with phone cases. I mean, you can, but there's t-shirts, there's pillows, there's all kinds of things, mugs, book covers. And basically this is what they call print on demand. Now, it's not going to make you rich. It's not going to make you thousands of dollars the next week, but this is a good side hustle for anyone. You know why? You do the work once. You create these patterns once. You put it there. I'm going to show you which site to use. And then it's just passive. You know, it sells on its own. And it's digital files, right? You don't have to deal with the physical products. You don't have to ship anything. It's digital file that people can take, download, and then just print it themselves. Or you can do it the physical way. You can print these things yourself. Honestly, I don't know why people skip on this opportunity. They think it's too hard, but it's simple. You just have to get through the first two days of just setting everything up. And then it's just going to be on autopilot. It's really, really good for anyone. You know, you don't have to have any kind of investment. You can use these free tools. And then you just have to sit there and make everything. Let me just show you. I use a website which is called Redbubble redbubble.com. I'm not affiliating with it. And all you got to do here when you come, just make yourself an account and this is your button, right? Sell your art. You click on it and you sign up as an artist here. So artist sign up, set up shop and start selling your designs. And this is the inside of it. Once you make yourself an account, just click here on your account, click on sell your art here. And then all you got to do is to, as you can see, they just lead you through it. You have to create the products, you have to set up the shop, and of course, you're going to get paid once you sell these. So all you got to do now, click on add new work, which is the button right here. Then click on this button, upload new work here, this one. And then of course, we're going to put that pattern here. And now just watch the magic of it. You don't have to do anything. You can just put a, get a title, right? So title can be anything. And down there, you can choose the products, right? Now, 
you have t-shirts, hats, you've got these magnets, and of course my favorite ones, because they look so good, are these phone cases. This goes like crazy, right? But if you want to make a pillow, you can make a pillow. If you want to make a mouse pad, you can make that. If you want to make a shower curtain, you can just do that. But there's a little bit of, you know, you have to play with it. Like, for example, you can just edit this one, and then you just have to choose a pattern here, which is going to be a regular grid always, so you can just be the entire shirt, right, if you want to do that. But phone cases are really, really good. And yeah, you can scale the images. Let me just go with the phone case. You can scale the image, for example, if you just want about that. And then, of course, choose the pattern always on a regular grid here. And whichever one of these scaling options you choose, you can see it changes right here. So let me just show you. So yeah, it can be big and it can be smaller, whatever you do. It's really, really good. And just to show you these, $14 for this one collage, $14 for this one. This is the mock-up. This is not actual phone case. $17 for this one, $14 for this one. This is really, really good. Here's one really similar to ours, right? So let me just go into it. On Etsy, this one is $19, right? It's $19. And you know what's the best part about this one? Redbubble will print your things. That's why it's called print on demand and they will ship it for you, right? So for example, you make a shop on Etsy or wherever you like, and then a customer places an order for you. It goes to Redbubble. They will print this on a phone case and then they will just send the phone case to your client. You get the money and of course, Redbubble, you have to give them the commission. It's really beautiful, right? It's a good side hustle that anyone can do. Basically, teenagers can do this one. It's easy. Now, one thing is going to be important as well, and that is your marketing. And, you know, you don't have to have a lot of followers. You just have to have an Instagram page like this one. As you can see, only 3K followers. And you just have to redirect people to your Etsy page if you're going to use Etsy, right? So as you can see, this person is using a lot of items, mugs, whatever, and they have this. So this is the link in the bio. And if you click on it, this is the link, as you can see. It's their Etsy shop, it's their Shopify shop, so they're just redirecting the traffic that they got on Instagram to their products. Linktree is free to use as well. You can just Google for it like this, Linktree, so it's link and bio tool. You make yourself an account and then you can place whatever you want on that link tree. So basically, whenever someone clicks on your link on Instagram, you can put a button there that will going to lead them to Etsy shop. And as I've told you, you just have to create these images with AI. It's popular, really, really popular nowadays. And then you can just put it on top of all these products, right? You don't have to stick to phone cases. I like them. I don't know. They make me money. It's not like millions of dollars, but I do get a few hundred dollars sometimes six to nine hundred dollars passively right completely passively i invested like few days in order to create some of these right maybe 10 15 20 variations and then it's on etsy right it's on etsy and whenever customers place orders well redbubble is printing that out and it's shipping it it's cool it's really really good now redbubble has all the help you need all right redbubble is always there to explain to you what do you have to do, how to connect all these things. If you want me to make a fully, like, longer video to break all of this down, to go step by step, you can just write me down in the comments. But honestly, it's a breeze, right? It's really a breeze. So you just have to generate images, which is a free tool, Janus. Then you put them on these products on Redbubble. And then, of course, you use Etsy. And yeah, marketing. Whatever the traffic count. If you bring only 50 people from Instagram to your shop page per month, it's going to be enough, right? It's totally going to be enough because you're not looking to make millions out of this because that's almost impossible. You're just looking to get a side hustle for yourself, which works. And this one works, but you have to work on it. Play with it for a few weeks and you're going to see that it's not so hard. It's an opportunity after all. So yeah, wish you good luck and I'll catch you in the next one.